stuff. Trouble in Toyland. A consumer watchdog group is sounding the alarm about potentially dangerous toys this holiday season. It's the latest topic for our Three on Your Side podcast. So Susan Campbell is here with a preview, and they always put out these warnings, don't they? They do. Last year, about 200,000 kids went to the ER to be treated for a toy related injury. For our latest podcast, Gary Harper and I chatted with Hannah Rhodes. She is a consumer watchdog associate with the Arizona Perg Education Fund. She says toys with choking hazards and counterfeit toys are some of the biggest threats of the holiday gift giving season. Toys are a little bit different than other products. While a counterfeit bag may just have poor quality, Counterfeit toys have serious implications. Toys are tested for strict safety tests, including toxic chemicals, small parts, and how children use and abuse them. The idea that a child could get their hands on a toy that has not been tested for safety is extremely alarming. Are there telltale signs that we should be watching out for that might kind of be that red flag to a consumer, a mom or dad who's shopping for that last minute gift right now? Yeah, absolutely. When you're looking at a product description online, it's really important to actually read through the entire thing, kind of identify if there's any mislabelings or misspellings. Researching the seller can be helpful as well too, seeing where they're located, um, seeing where they sell other products. Uh, do they have a real website? There is a QR code on your screen right now that will take you right to the podcast where we cover some of the other big threats that may come with popular toys. We're talking everything from smart toys to toys that are too noisy, even recalled toys that end up being sold secondhand. Remember, you can download the three on your side podcast anywhere you get podcasts.